math. Why do I have to learn this? And when am I ever going to use this in real life? You may not know it, but math is all around you. You may not recognize it, but it is always there. You use math and see math every day. Open your eyes and take a look. Patterns. Patterns are found in construction materials, everything from brick walls to walkways. Patterns can be found in tiled floors, rooftops, stairwells, even the wind can make patterns in sand. Symmetry. Symmetry is often found in nature, in leaves, flowers, and plants. Nature also provides examples of symmetry in the faces and bodies of animals and other living things. Symmetry is also found in many man-made objects, such as windmills, flags, sculptures, guitars, and even eyeglasses. Symmetry can also be found in many different types of architecture. Measurement. Precise measurements are necessary to build things such as houses and buildings. We use measurement when cooking and baking and also to determine the right number of servings we should have from each food group each day. Gauges are found in our vehicles to measure our speed and thermometers are used to measure the temperature. Measurement determines capacity and area. How much is needed to fill the balloons and pool? How much is needed to cover the field? Time. Time is measured through clocks, sundials, calendars, watches, and date books. Scheduling keeps track of arrival and departure times for traveling by plane, train, or bus. Estimation. We use estimation skills to figure out how many things there are in each of these pictures. We would also estimate to figure out how many people are at each of these events. Money. Money skills are very important. Do you know if you receive the right amount of change or the right amount of money from the ATM? Money skills are also important when shopping, whether it's for groceries or clothes or determining sale prices. Fresh produce such as fruits and vegetables are priced by the pound. Can you figure out how much your purchase will cost? When eating out at restaurants, do you know how to split up the bill or figure out the right tip to leave? Geometry, shapes, lines, and angles. We can find geometric shapes in many man-made objects. Just look at all the squares, rectangles, triangles, and circles. We can also find geometric shapes and angles in many natural and man-made objects. Fractions, decimals, and percents. Fractions are used to split pizzas and pies. Percents are used to figure out batting averages and sale prices. Probability. Probability is used to determine the likelihood of success among competitors in games of chance and sporting events. Problem solving. Are you a good problem solver? Can you figure out a way out of this maze? How to get your luggage from the bottom of the pile? Or figure out a strategy to help you win the game? So as you can see, math is always around us. Whether we see it in nature or man-made objects, whether we use it to shop, cook, eat, tell time, find the temperature, measure, solve problems, or play games, math is always around us. Take a look around. Where do you see math each day?